My name is Buffy Yensing. I am Director of Customer Success. And what that means is that I work with any of all of our partners and clients, really success, their success is what my whole focus of my position is about. So a typical day is really back-to-back -back meetings. And it's meetings with anybody and everybody. I start a meeting out with my team. Um, we get an update as to what new features or benefits have come out. We own our own technology platform, so we work with the development team to make sure that they understand what our clients need, what issues our clients are having. I really am a relationship manager at heart, and I like to get to know people, not only what they need from a business standpoint, but who they are as people. So I was a literature major. I read a lot. I thought I was going to law school. <laughs> I had an uncle who owned a successful advertising uh, agency in Chicago. He said, would you like to work for my agency? And I said, I, I don't know. And I finally decided to, and I started as a receptionist. I then went to work with clients, and then I grew from there in the industry. The industry changed, so I had to figure out if that's what I wanted to do or find a new path. And I happened to know somebody that worked in this industry and worked for a company that said we're, we're interviewing. And I said, okay, I'll give it a shot. And here I am six years later, running a team of eight and loving every minute of it because it's high pace, it's always changing. There's constant learning. Where I was in my career in advertising helped me work through tense situations, high pressure deadlines, it translated very well into what I do now, and so, and I like this more. <laughs>When I started in this particular career, I got frustrated probably a few months in. Because when you're dealing with people's money, when you're dealing with technology and money, people get very frustrated, they get very angry, they get um, irate. And I started to get frustrated because that's what I was dealing with was tension, a lot of tension. The president of the company said, walk in their shoes. Think about it from their perspective. And it was the difference between night and day. And since that point, I have never stopped thinking from their perspective. What would I feel if somebody were holding my money? What would I feel like if, you know, my business wasn't running as it was supposed to? And, you know, there have been tears on the phone and I've almost cried with my <laughs> clients, maybe getting a little too empathetic. But empathy is very important. Failure is a scary word. Nobody likes to fail. But failure happens, and it's how you deal with the failure and what you learn. So having to change careers after 15 years was challenging. It was difficult. I could, I could look back and say I failed. But I was able to look at that as how much did I learn through all of that? and what doors opened because of it. It's being able to accept what comes. You know, the day may not turn out as I had originally planned and it's just being flexible and being able to work with what happens to come up to that, you know, to that day.